The education area is primarily focused on the undergraduate experience, and that is asking questions of what do we want a Stanford education to be in the next 10, 15 years? How do we want to reach students where they are, and knowing where they are, what sort of environment for education do we need to create? Our team is charged with envisioning the future of our undergraduate residences on campus. We spoke to more than 500 different individuals. We accepted every request to meet with any group on campus, and we received over 600 pieces of feedback through our online web form. I was actually surprised by how intentional the committee was on gaining student input. What students said had a lot of weight when it came to our meetings. But even though students had complaints, um, perhaps about you know, systems like the draw, uh, about the variance in housing across campus, uh, students also articulated a sense of uh, identity from housing. You have students coming together at the beginning of the year, uh, deciding this is the dorm we want to be, this is the culture we want to have. Creating moments of community, allowing a dorm to have a culture through the year, I think is very Stanfordian. And we want to make sure that the system of housing um, in the future includes those components of, of student agency and student independence. The key here is that the residences have to be places of learning and community and exploration and discovery. That's what enables us at Stanford to ensure that we're educating the whole person. The final report of the task force is now in the hands of university leadership and will be presented to the Board of Trustees in April. And we're excited for feedback on our recommendations from all of those groups. Our committee was charged to think about uh, whether our first year students should have a common intellectual experience and if so, what that experience should look like. What we see is an opportunity uh, to capitalise on that desire amongst the students to have some kind of shared experience and combine it with an opportunity to expose them to different ideas, different ways of thinking, different disciplines. We saw common themes emerge around the purpose of a liberal education. So liberal education is ultimately about education for free citizens. The liberal doesn't have anything to do with a political position, it just comes from the Latin libertas or freedom. So the freedom to, to take a number of classes in different areas, but also the idea of freeing your mind from social conformity, these are deep, important values that I think are central to this university. We see it as our responsibility to give them a, a forum in which they can discuss these big ideas and uh, figure out what those ideas mean to them and, and how they will interact with the changing world when they leave Stanford. We're really trying to speak to as many faculty and students as possible to get their feedback on these proposals. Then come fall 2019, we will start to engage with the various committees and other parts of the university for implementing the proposals. We were charged really to think about what a Stanford major should become in the coming decades and how it can remain uh, nicely fitted into a broad liberal education at Stanford, even as the amount of disciplinary knowledge and the different fields of various majors continues to expand at an incredibly rapid pace. A lot of members of the community were very excited and charged up about the importance for students of the future of active learning and project-based uh, learning in which the students are thinking for themselves with the tools that they have uh, built up and cultivated in their education. And we think there's a real chance to reorient the major around that kind of learning, in particular by doing a better job of delivering for every Stanford student a really robust capstone experience in their major where the student has a chance to think for herself with the tools that she's cultivated in the course of her study within the major. So what we've been doing uh, this quarter is uh, working very hard to develop a preliminary set of proposals and a preliminary report that we can take out into the community during spring quarter and uh, discuss with various stakeholders and get that important feedback. Then over the summer, we'll refine our proposals and 
come up with a detailed report that we can put before the Faculty Senate next year.